Welcome to Monday Morning Prayer as we remember Perpetua, Felicity and their companions, Martyrs. God's love has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit who has been given to us. Glory to God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and for ever. Amen. The opening canticle, a song of God's marvellous acts. I will sing a new hymn to my God. O Lord, you are great and marvellous. You are marvellous in your strength, invincible. Let the whole creation serve you, for you spoke and all things came to be. You sent out your spirit and it formed them. No one can resist your voice. Mountains and seas are stirred to their depths. Rocks melt like wax at your presence. But to those who revere you, you still show mercy. The night has passed and the day lies open before us. Let us pray with one heart and mind. As we rejoice in the gift of this new day, so may the light of your presence, O God, set our hearts on fire with love for you, now and for ever. Amen. The psalm today is Psalm 19. It begins, The heavens declare the glory of God, and the firmament proclaims his handiwork. One day tells it to another and night to night communicates knowledge. You may wish to pause the video here to complete the remainder of the psalm. Creator Spirit, advocate promised by our Lord Jesus, increase our faith and help us to walk in the light of your presence to the glory of God the Father, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Today's reading is Hebrews chapter 3, verses 1 to 14. It begins, Therefore, brothers and sisters, holy partners in a heavenly calling, consider that Jesus, the apostle and high priest of our confession, was faithful to the one who appointed him, just as Moses also was faithful in all God's house. You may wish to pause the video here to complete the remainder of the reading. May your word live in us and bear much fruit to your glory. The Canticle, a song of Isaiah. Behold, God is my salvation. I will trust and will not be afraid. For the Lord God is my strength and my song and has become my salvation. With joy you will draw water from the wells of salvation. On that day you will say, give thanks to the Lord, call upon his name, make known his deeds among the nations, proclaim that his name is exalted. Sing God's praises who has triumphed gloriously. Let this be known in all the world. Shout and sing for joy, you that dwell in Zion, for great in your midst is the Holy One, of Israel. Lord have mercy, Christ have mercy, Lord have mercy. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. A collect for Perpetua and her companions. Jesus Christ, your glory shines through pain and brutality. We praise you for Perpetua and her four companions, who chose baptism and therefore to be mauled by beasts and killed. 
May we choose baptism, wherever it may lead. Amen. You may wish to pause the video here to say intercessions, prayers and thanksgivings. Eternal God and Father, by whose power we are created and by whose love we are redeemed, guide and strengthen us by your Spirit, that we may give ourselves to your service and live this day in love to one another and to you, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you, and also with you. Let us praise the Lord. Thanks be to God. God did not give us a spirit of cowardice, but a spirit of power and of love and of self-discipline. May we rekindle the gift of God within us. Amen.